Okay, we're back. So our goal is to get from here to here. All right, so you are going to make a zero. So in this case, we've got a negative two, so we're gonna add two X to both sides. Add two X to both sides. And we've got a zero and three Y equals two X minus six. So that negative six and two X are not like terms, so you write them right next to each other. Divide by three. And we have y equals two thirds x minus two. Okay, and you're done. And by the way, this is your slope, your rise over run. How much is y changing over how much is x changing? Okay, so our last one here that I'm gonna do in our example, uh, actually second to the last one, I'm gonna try to get another one in before people start banging down the door. So subtract two x from both sides, you're always gonna be subtracting x. Okay, and we've got negative three y equals negative 2x plus 6 okay divide by negative 3 divide by negative 3 divide by negative 3 and you have y equals 2 over 3x minus 2 so this negative 2 and negative 3 became a positive so it's positive 2 over 3 and 6 divided by negative 3 is negative 2 all right our last one of the video and then you guys are on your own for the rest we have a, a negative two here, so to make a zero, we're gonna add the opposite, which is positive two x. Do not forget the x. Add two x, and we've got three y equals two x plus six. Divide by three on everything. And we've got y equals two thirds x plus two. Again, this is your slope, six divided by three, 2 divided by 3 stays a fraction, and you are done. Okay, that's your two-minute video.